What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the internet. I'm your host, uh... You know what? It doesn't matter. We're doing a Vintage Cube Draft. And there's a stipulation from Ilyar Skinny, a Patreon supporter and subscriber on the internet. And uh, the stipulation is... Draft a combo deck with an infinite combo. If you see a piece of an infinite combo like Kiki, then you must take it. Power trumps everything and colors don't matter. So, like, Kiki Jiki. What else? What other infinite combos are in the cube? I guess we'll see them when, we, when they come to us. As far as I know, that's it. That might be the only infinite combo. But I will also take other combos, like Natural Order or Nahiri. Through the Breach. Through the beach. Through the beach. This is a combo piece. Restoration Angel is also a combo piece, actually. With uh, Kiki Jiki. True. Yeah, it's probably... Restoration Angel is probably more of an infinite... Restoration Angel is an infinite combo piece. Whereas Mind's Desire is just a, an annoying combo piece. So, we are going to take the Restoration Angel... Nev Disc plus Dark Steel. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's a combo. Real men take Mind's Desire. Well, I guess I'm a fake man. I don't think Dark Steel Citadel or whatever is in this cube. You don't think nine mana? Oh, Dark Steel Citadel. You mean Dark Steel Forge? Is that what it is? Foundry? Uh, Forge, Foundry. Uh. That's good. Forge, Foundry, I don't know. Forge. Forge. It's only nine mana. It's a reasonable cost. It's not. Snot? Snot. Snot. Two restos can have an infant? No, they can't, because they can't target angels. Come on. Get it together. They can't target themselves. Uh, Hollowed Fountain is a pick. Chandra is a pick. Living Death? Are you an infinite combo? Probably not. I like Hollowed Fountain here. But I like, but I like, 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 like a bucket here. Binga lunga ling lunga. Oh, Soulfire Grandmaster and Time Walk is a combo. That is correct. That's a good one. That is a good one. Opposition's an infinite combo. <laughs> I'll infinitely tap down all of your things. Uh, none of these are infinite combos. I think it's still probably Opposition, right? Mm hmm. I mean, that's a good card to build around third pick. Mike, you got a ghost behind you. He's right, you do. I don't know how to get rid of it. I don't think I can. Yeah, well. Did you ever try to suck less? No, I hadn't tried that. Well, joke's on you. Get wrecked. You like getting wrecked? It's alright. Getting wrecked is alright? It's alright. Good talk. What's your food plan, man? Set up that Tijuana Flats. No. Why not? I don't like you. Oh. Should have stayed that from the start. It would have been easier. Well, I was just asking what your food plan was. Oh, through the breach. That's not an infinite combo, but that's a combo piece. And I think it's probably stronger than, like, a Celestial Colony here. Considering what stipulation we're doing, yes. I want to live that just guy life. The green screen looks like it's part of Mike's hair. Yeah, it is. It's actually he's got a he's got a mullet right now. That's his Mike mullet. It's the ghost of Mike's ponytail. No, nah, man, it was a rat tail. You're a rat tail. Your mother's a rat tail. There are no combo pieces. Therefore, polluted delta is a good pick. Is it? Is it? I forgot what the blue black guild was called. Demir. There we go. Demir land? Is it Ravages of War though? What if we Ravages of War? Get in as a combo piece. Uh not not it's not really though. It does make your opponent concede often. Hmm. 
Hum, 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 hum. You have a motorcycle? I, <laughs> once. Once. Faith is looting, I guess? It seems really bad. I mean, it's pretty good in combo when you're trying to dig. It's, I mean, if you're already blue, though, I don't really care about Faithless looting. I like. I don't mind brainstorm when we have Delta already. I'd rather have the brainstorm than the Faithless looting. Yeah, they're pretty similar. Oh, Dire Fleet to Daredevil. Looter's pretty good, especially the opposition. Yeah, that seems fine. I'll take a looter. A looty tooty. High tide came back. Yeah, we're too. I'm not going. I'm not gonna be steam. I'm not gonna be storming. Tiden. I'm not gonna be tiding. Wow. Wow. I mean, the table's pretty often. I'm not really surprised. I am. Gotta get him with the got him. I like the got him. All the banishing light might be better. Nah, you never, never, never not gotten them. Also, we might not even be white here. Hey, Fire Ice is good. It's a fine card. Blade Splicer is two bodies for opposition. I guess it's just Banalis Champion. None of these cards are good. None of these cards are getting played. You got played. You done played yourself. Ooh, we have Bonfire and Brainstorm, which is actually pretty good. I kind of like Joyra here, but I think it's actually Magma Jet. We're not a Joyra deck. Well, maybe we are a Joyra deck, but it's too late. Damage is done, man. It's too late. Oh, it's too late. I don't... What's wrong with you? Too late. It is too late for you. That's... Hmm. You're not respecting the stipulation? How am I not respecting it? It's infinite combos. There is no infinite combos that we passed. I think it's Volcanic Island. Yeah, actually, I didn't even... wasn't even thinking about that. I think it's definitely Volcanic Island. Ooh, Flooded Strand is a good one. Um, Enlightened Tutor is actually really good if we get Kiki Jiki Splinter Twin. It also searches for opposition, which is pretty gas. True. Yeah, I think that our land is pretty good right now. We have four, four lucky lose. Actually, that goes in the main deck. I don't know. I put it in the sideboard there. Counterspell, Imperial Recruiter. That gets combo pieces. It's true. All right, we're really going deep on the. Uh, it can also get like Looter or Blade Splicer. We're going deep on hoping we hit the Kiki Jiki Splinter Twin, but. You know, there's a Palancron. What does that do? Nothing on its own. Right. But it has friends. What are its friends? A card we already passed, High Tide. That's... Okay, well, sure. Okay, you got me. Palancron and High Tide. If we have enough lands out, <laughs> is is infinite. I, yes. I don't know if I agree with that. Uh... Oblivion Ring? Angel of Sanctions? Probably just Oblivion Ring. One cost three, one cost five. I think I know what camp I belong to. Which, you're in a camp? Mm-hmm. Wow, I didn't know you went to camp. What camp did you go to? Camp my dad. Camp my dad? Seacrum Coast or Upheaval? This does not seem like an Upheaval deck. Was it because we have zero man artifact mana? That would be why, yes. That's a good reason. I can get behind that. You're a two drop. Quit trying to quit trying to be a four drop. What up, Agent Code Ganks? Ayo. Oh, path is good. I like a good path. 
I like Mother of Runes too, actually, if we get the combo. Yeah. She also attack. She also protect. Yeah, I'll take sword here. Oh, we get the mana tithe. We can get the. Oh, we get a recruiter. We can get double dudes. Double dudes. I'll take the recruiter. We're going deep on this, on this plan. Better hope it works out. Don't tell me what to hope. This deck actually looks pretty good outside of that. I mean, we do really want the guys. Possession. I think Disenchant's probably stronger than Spectral. Especially in this cube. Yeah, Resto plus Kiki is basically just twin combo. We're hoping for Kiki Jiki. We're also hoping for like an Emrakul. What did Mike give me for my birthday? Uh, disappointment. He he got me a lifetime of disappointment. <laughs> it's been a it's been an uphill battle. It's too late to apologize. Yeah, I think you guys are getting regular combos confused with infinite combos. These bits seems good. What does that mean? <laughs> what does that even mean? Oh, good times. Well, we got the palancron. That's cool. Oh, I got the angel back. Everybody wins. Guess who's back? Angel's, Angel's back. back. Oh, another angel. All right. This is a good one with the opposition. Oh, we literally skipped all of the combo pieces? Wow, I thought we only skipped literally one. <laughs> I thought it was literally just high tide. I guess all of them is probably more accurate because... Let's take library. Yeah, Alexander. library is an infinite combo piece. Yeah, that's pretty much it in here. Oh. Yeah, we do have... Actually, we have three angels. We have Resto. Also, uh, Imperial Recruiter can get Angel of Invention, which is pretty Ooh, sick. That is spicy. Both of them can get Mom. Um, well, still nothing. Soulfire Grandmaster, in case we get that time walk. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure we'll get... A fourth pick time walk. What problem is? I still think I, th I still it's a fine card. Yeah, I think it's the pick. Dang it! Manic Vandal or Skull Clamp? This feels this could be a Skull Clamp deck, especially with Double Recruiter just to throw out, Blade Splicer to throw out. We got a bunch of throwaway creatures. Yeah. Yeah, I like Skull Clamp here a lot. Birthday bits. Thanks so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. My roommates are huge fans. My parents love you. I've trained my dog to drool when you start streaming, but I don't think you understand the game of Magic the Cat. Maybe that's true. I feel like this has been a problem for a long time. Through the Breaching Progenitus doesn't really give us the uh, the desired outcome. Okay, you go to 10. Have fun. All right. Oh, you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna combo me out next turn. Good game. Um. Fast bond because of the stiff. That doesn't mean what's the, what's the infinite combo with fast bond. <laughs> you know, playing lands. Oh, that's a good one. Good. It's a good combo. Your bond has been fast. I like sacred foundry, but I also like monastery mentor in this deck, especially yeah, again need, with opposition. We need duders. Pass on Strip and Crucible. Like, <laughs> we don't have any of those. <laughs> there has been no Crucible. Oh, man. That's... Or Strip Mine. It's also not an infinite combo. It's just a combo. Mentor seems good for this deck. Yeah. 
And we can search for him again with both of these dudes. You guys might want to reread this dip. Yeah, I don't I don't consider that an infinite combo. Like that's just literally like That's just a combo. <laughs> it's, yeah, right. Like I mean Okay, so I just literally have to know of every obscure combo that any, like, if anything has some sort of obscure infinite iteration, I have to know about that before I take a pick. Good to know. You guys are making this a lot less fun than it actually than it actually is. Oh, man. Don't you know about Fast Bond, Strip Mine, Crucible of World? That's an infinite combo, so you have to take each one of those pieces if you see them in the third pack. Oh, all right. Well, that's good. I'll, I'll keep that in mind. I'll make sure to take that next time. Fumeral here? What about Fiery Confluence? Fiery Confluence is good, but I'm reluctant to take a double red card. We don't have any double red cards right now. That's a fair point. Confluence is very, very good, though. I also like Preordain. I wouldn't mind a Preordain. It's good with the. Uh, we have to cut some here. Mentor. Oh, uh, Amira Angel actually seems great with the... This is actually a pretty reasonable opposition deck now. Brimaz, also a good opposition card. <laughs> it's alright. This is a pretty okay... I don't think they just wanted me to draft Twin. I never said that. I never, I never said they just wanted me to draft Twin. But... I also can't just take a fast spawn in pack three and hope I get uh, Crucible of Worlds and Strip Mine. Like, and that's super obscure for one thing. It's also not an infinite combo that wins you the game. If it's a, if if it's a if it's an infinite combo, I can do it forever. I can't do that forever because I'll literally die. Like, that's just ridiculous. So it's just these are very weird like criticism you guys are making right now. I'm also probably not going to use this as a sip because we didn't actually get any infinite combos. So we're probably just drafting a Jeskai deck. Mirren Crusader seems pretty good, right? Is it Mirren Crusader or Hangerback Walker? I think Hairback is better in general. It's also better with a Skull Clampu. Hairback? Hairback Walker. This came back? Mm. I'm not so sure how many islands we're going to have. Like, we're just going to have, like, a Jeskai deck splashing green for one, one fast bond, and we're like, well, we never drew it because we couldn't get our green source. Like... It's just very strange. We have both of the XX artifact eaters. Dankus right. Dags. Thanks so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Um, I don't want Wrath of God. A Danto Vanguard is fine, I guess. I don't know. None of these cards are probably going to... Oh, look. The Fast Bond came back. Now we can take it. <laughs> Bam. Look at that. No, I'm taking this Leon and Relic Warder. <laughs> I'm taking the actual card that we'll play. Eh, Incinerate's fine. Nah, Revelock seems better here. Oh my god, that's surprising, actually. Right. That's extremely playable. Revelock might be pretty good in our deck. I agree with you. We gotta make some cuts, though. Through the Breach probably seems like a cut. Agreed. <sighs> Lightning Mother Runes, Brainstorm. Lightning Tutor. Is that. Nah, it's still pretty good, actually. It's really good. It gets Control Magic, Opposition. Sword, Skull Clamp. Probably cut Brainstorm. Oblivion Ring. Yeah, I could see cutting Brainstorm, especially with Preordain. <laughs> Angel of Invention combo. You know, where you play it and then you cast the... Where you, where you threw the Breach and then you put Angel of Invention into play and uh, then it dies. That's the combo. That's a good one. It's a solid combo. Yeah, I think this deck is sweet, actually. Um, it does a lot of things. Do we cut one of these guys? I could see that. I don't think so, though. We have Skull, we have skull Clamp, though. 
Why don't we just cut Bonfire, because it always forsakes us. Well, then I'm... Yeah, we also cut Brainstorm. I can see that. Uh, stop going to the 4-drop spot. I think we can cut Confluence from the main deck. And this is probably our 23. It's a lot easier on the mana, too. Yeah, agreed. Alright, so, sort by the color here. It's almost, it's almost worth cutting the red altogether, maybe. We have enough playables? Oh, yeah, I mean, we can cut three of these and add, like, Relic Warder, Revel Arc, and... Disenchant. Or, like, any Hangerback Walker Ballista. Yeah, that might be worth it. How good is our red fixing? We have Volcanic Island, Steam Vents, Polluted Delta. Mm. It's not great. Confluence does has an impact, but I mean, we only have three red sources right here, and we actually can get away with probably adding like one one mountain here. Yeah, I think we cut the red. That seems good. Oh, we also have Fire Ice, though. That might actually convince me. We just don't lose a lot from adding red, though. Yeah, that's fine. We'll play it like this. Whatever. Six, seven, eight, nine, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That seems good. Two, three, four, five. That seems fine. Yep. Yep, 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 Apart from Twin, what are the infinite comic pieces? I don't know. Are there some bits more beneficial for sure, or are they the same as far as... Uh, bits are probably more beneficial because the the uh, the fee is taken out of your end. Donations, there's a fee taken out of my end. So if you donate $5, uh, I'll probably see like 435 of that or something. You know, whatever. Whatever the fee is. I just made that number up. But if you donate $5 in bits... Um, I should get all five dollars of that because you actually had to pay like five sixty or something for the bits. So interestingly enough, the bits actually are a little bit better for streamers. But I mean, realistically, if you're gonna donate or 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 cheer, send bits to a streamer, either way is fine. I I don't think anyone should really be criticizing how you support a streamer because that's just just awesome. The donations do let you pay forth the fee, so you get the... Uh, not not in my experience, no, because donations either go through Streamlabs, in which case they take a percentage because you have the platform... Oh, donations have an option for us to pay the fee for... Oh, I didn't even know that. I had no idea that was a thing. I've never seen that before. Really? Got him. <laughs> Ah! Oh, feels good. Oh, let's loot her here. Wow, I had no idea that was a thing. That's super awesome. Wow. For anyone who's for anyone who's paid the fee on went on donations, that is super cool. Thank you guys so much. I didn't even know that was a thing. Wow. Wow. Very aggressive. We could play Recruiter. What if we go Recruiter grab Skull Clamp? That seems good, right? Or not Recruiter. Uh, Tutor. Now, we got to do Recruiter first because then we get to... Uh, we want to put the guy in our hand, and we're going to shuffle our library, so we have to do this before we enlighten Tutor. Um, Monster Mentor is probably the pick, right? I think that's pretty good, yes. Because next we can go Mentor into Tutor. Thanks, Tags. Here's more bits for the Force Spike value. Thank you so much, buddy. Got him. Uh-oh. Oh. Are you going to kill this guy? You have to kill this guy. They don't, they don't, but 
I mean, they could if they wanted to. Is this a creature? Mm -mm. Dang it. It's close, though. Could have been. But in the future. <sighs> Planeswalker's too OP. I mean, Mentor is pretty good here. Oh, oh let's not tap like that. that. <laughs> don't do it like that. Don't do it like that. Because we can get Skull Clamp here and. Um... Hey, look, it turned into an Emrakul. I know. It's, I don't know why it does that. It's so weird, dude. Uh, also, Sword could be really good here against them, but I yeah. think Skull Clamp is like we're gonna make another make a bunch of monks. Mike has mullet stream. Yeah, <laughs> I like to rock the mullet. You know, I think they're gonna Chandra this guy, so that seems business okay. up front, party in the back. Mike, don't mess around. Oh, they didn't actually kill Monastery Mentor. Are you gonna kill the board? You gonna wipe my board? I don't care about any of these things. I have control magic, brah. Con control magic, make a guy. Oh, this is going to be... This oh, is I didn't attack? What? This is going to be brutal. Yeah, it is. Make a guy, and we and we, and we we get the buffs. This is game. They got a scoop here, right? This is, like, super bad. Look at all these things we're doing. All right, so what kind of damage we got? We can go four and one at Chandra, and then seven at you. Four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I feel like we're in good shape here. Yeah, that was pretty brutal. Why did you kill Monastery Mentor? Like we got Skull Clamp. Isn't that just to be like? Fair, they don't... Oh wait, yes, they do know that. Actually. Yeah, they have to because it's a specific type. Hanging out. Um, I guess we draw some cards here. And we try to hit a spell that gives us prowess. Give me that. Give me the spells, boy. I just want to keep. I want. I just want to keep digging. This is... Skull Clamp is not a reasonable magic card. Oh, that's a pretty good one. Why did you wait to do that? <laughs> that seems very strange. Oh, uh, it's an instant. I have to play it as an instant. That was a good voice he did there. No more red mana for you. Let's make sure we're tapping the right thing. Click on you, tap you. All right. Jokes on you. I drew a bouted. All right. That's the end of the game. We had a good run. And that's how we beat our opponent with our good run. I think when you win, that's a pretty good run. I agree. I don't think we want to board anything here. Didn't see any artifacts or enchantments, so. You're an artifact and an enchantment. Get wrecked. Wow. That is, uh. Do you choose where ads go on YouTube? I think it would be nice if they're in between packs and games. Uh, I can choose, but that is a lot of... Um, that is a lot of... It's, it takes a lot of work. Let's put it that way. Especially for every single video, and there's two a day. It's a lot. To, it's a lot of, like, tedious... I'm going to mulligan this hand. <laughs> <coughs> oh, this hand seems worse, but if we get a white source at all... Do we keep this? Yeah, it's all right. We're on the draw, too. I don't even care. Chase has a lot of text. Chase has so much text, it was actually in two messages. That's pretty funny. All 
All right, white man on the top. You ready? I'm waiting. I'll abrade your skull clamp. That would be wise. You're right. I'll never let them have. I'll never let them have my skull clamp. That's the. That's not what we wanted, but. Nope. I accept it as a show. Lame. Didn't. Oh, I see. You're gonna take one of my cards, one white cards that I can't cast. That's cool. Jokes on you. Can't even cast them. Got them. How many bits for Mike to eat a taco on stream? Oh, probably not many at all. He'll probably do that for free, to be quite honest. You have to be a glorious mess. You're a glorious mess. Yes. Mess. Is it Tuesday already? Man, when did it get to be Tuesday? Yesterday. Why do they keep remaking Bad Predator movies? Can we just not... They took the five mana card? I do not understand. I'm going to use this guy and get a thing. Did we just get Monastery Mentor again? <laughs> it's very good. Yeah. Uh, uh, we can also just get the other recruiter. Next turn, go recruiter equip. Uh, yeah, we could do that. I mean, we're under like no pressure here whatsoever, so... Sure. Does Red let you access those rent buy movies for cheap or free? That is I it. <laughs> I don't know. You mean Red Mana? I don't know. I don't know how Red Mana works in the real world. Oh, Dark Ritual. Here we go. What is this? What's happening? Oh, Mind Twist. I don't mind that as much just because we have Skull Clamp, so. Draw two. Blades Blesser. Resto? That's actually pretty good. I hope they try to play Chandra here. Oh man, it's going to be the best if they try to play a Chandra here. It's not a Chandra at all. Liliana. Oh boy, get him. Get him. And you received get him bits. Wow. And we got the get him bits at the same time. It was like the... Uh, the the bit trifecta there. Yeah, we're just going to resto and and, st and kill this mesmeric fiend when it tries to get in my life. Mind Twist is an infinite combo. They made me discard infinite cards. So that's pretty good. Alright, let's see the Vraska's Contempt. Oh, that's why he, well, he paid the ultimate price, eh, Dade? Sure. Sure. Sure, mate. <laughs> I don't understand why the Gotham guy has to put his butt on poor little Fibble Thip. Well, you see, when you when you grow up, things happen in life and uh you know you live with it man that was so sage like well i like to express my wisdom in mysterious ways you know can i get my angel oh ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. put you on the tippity top Let's get it. Let's go inventing, boys. To make some robots. Oh yeah, we're making robots all day. Serve them. So 
So they have two cards. We have a thousand cards. That's a good one. It's not a bad one. No, not before attacks. Why? Oh, wait, they're two twos. Come on, man. Yay. Hooray! Do we even want to attack? Yeah, probably. They don't have anything we care about. Also, this has vigilance, so that's pretty cool. You play a creature. I'll tap it. I'll tap it down. What in damn nation? Well, that's cool. I mean, it's a. It's actually they lose damnation. We lose angel, and then we draw two. So it's actually a two for none. Okay, well, that's a lot of lands. Do we jam the angel? Yeah, because then we can just put a clamper on it. Yeah, use that ability. Bust out the clamps. You know, the clamps that I use every day. Oh god, they're going to Vraska's Contempt it, which is very good, because it's exiled. And we don't get to trigger that. Hooray. No, not hooray. Oh. <laughs> Opposite of hooray. Alright, well that was a blank. Monastery Mentor. Brimaz! Cat Daddy. Young Cat Boy. That was a great draw, actually, because, well, you know, obvious reasons. Not only does he make cats for the opposition, but he makes cats for the skull clamp. He also makes cats four days. Four days a week. He didn't even tap a land? Man, you're such a sucker. I'm really bad at this game. <clears throat> Sorry, little kitty cat man. Kitty cat man! I still don't think we care about tapping lands. I think we'd rather just tap his creatures that they play. Yeah, this is a hell of a Skull Clamp deck. Stoneforge Mystic is like the only card that makes this deck better. That's the last time I'll ever tap Mom for opposition. <clears throat> Mom! Yes, my son. Are you my, are you my mom? Yes, it's my right. son. It's really awkward. Why? What do you mean, why? Tell me about it. Tell you about what? Tacos. Do you guys see what I have to endure in this friendship? It is brutal. Well, man, you don't like talking about tacos? Yes, that's my issue. Clearly. a lot of lands. Uh, I guess we'll equip. Don't equip mom. No, I would never do that to my mom. All right. What's better, eating flaming hot, licking flaming hot Cheeto dust off fingers or drinking cereal milk? That is your question. I would say drinking cereal milk. You think that's better? Yeah. Do you drink cereal milk? Yeah, what, you don't? No, that's... I don't know, man. It's just too weird. So you just let the, that... You just get rid of that milk? I don't use a, enough milk to really have that much in there, but... Yeah, I mean, like, if there's a little bit left over, I'll just toss it down the drain. Man. A little waster. You're a waster. This hand is great. This is already the third round? This is the second round. Oh. God, what... Are you... Did you black out again? Yeah, I think so. God, it's so sad. Wasteful. Oh boy. Oh boy. Huh? Do we got a hollowed fountain? I'll probably get a hollowed fountain now if we have a follow. Oh, 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 oh. We do. My fingers are already delicious. Five star dining at my fingertips. Not not okay. Oh, the upkeep top.
You gotta get on that milk. You're missing. <laughs> I don't know, man. It's usually flavored by the cereal as well. Yeah, clearly. But then it gets too sweet, and then I just feel like I'm drinking really sweet milk, and it's very weird. You don't like sweet milk? <laughs> Shouldn't be anything funny about that, but yet. No, yeah. there is something funny about it. Hey, man, you like that sweet milk? You know what you're saying. I'm going to top again. I'm gonna, Oh, they didn't top again. I guess they just knew what they were getting. They just knew what they were getting into. Interesting. Oh, you're going to click me? Do we magma jet this in response? Probably, right? Yeah. But then we can play Recruited this turn, or we can play Mentor this turn if they don't. I think this is actually fine. Because they can't counter a Mentor now, so we can just play Mentor, which is great. And then next turn we can Oblivion Ring this. What about drinking cereal milk while eating Cheeto dust off your fingers? Oh, no. Ugh. What if you had cereal? What if you had a uh, hot Cheeto cereal? No, just no. And then that no, was that, the milk that's left not over. a thing. For a reason. For a raisin? Yeah, for a raisin. For a raisin. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He's a raisin. What'd they take? Oblivion ring? Okay. But excuse me. Well, but excuse me. Let's play this guy. Yeah, I feel like this guy's relatively safe in their blue-green deck, but... Fill a bowl of Cheetos and milk. Eat it with your fingers. Let the world burn around you. <laughs> <laughs> it's not okay, man. Nature's a little juposhi, man. You got real problems, buddy. Nacho Doritos and chocolate is an infinite combo? Oh, no. I don't know about all that. Are there raisins in our Cheetos now? God, I hope not. Boy, I hope not. Are they going to control magic this guy? No, that's fine. I don't care about that idiot. I think we do a little bit. If they bounce this guy, we magma jet it. If they don't, we kill this and attack it. Like, yeah, that's fine. We can just magma jet your Jace now. We're like magma Jace... Whoa, 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 he's a lady. We can also just Monastery Mentor and Lightning Tutor, which seems pretty good here. Boom, 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 boom. Do, 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 do. What about a Dorito flavored soft taco? That seems reasonable. Yeah, I don't see any problem with that, actually. I was hungry a few minutes ago. This stream fixed that. That's just another service we provide. They have four cards. Oh, you're just going to bounce them again? Let's do the Enlightened Tutor. Enlightened O-Toots. Birds flying high. I think it's just Skull Clamp, because next turn we can actually play 3-drop and Skull Clamp, which seems pretty good. Probably Mentor. Plus we have Blade Splicer and Imperial Recruiter in hand, so our Clamp value is real high. Dorito flavored tacos are a Taco Bell thing, but only in hard shell, not soft shell. You're going to kill my mountain. It's pretty good if you kill my mountain. That's the dirtiest of the dirties. Well, you have no soul. That's sad. You look like a dude who had a soul before that point. Very aggressive.
Yep, now I just wish we got to land. Sad days are here again. Too much floaties. Guess we can kill Jace here. Or we can kill Dragon Predator and trade. Oh, Lord. What's better in the long run? The Trigon killing the Skull Clamp or the Jace? That is the question. <clears throat> also, this guy dies at the end of the turn naturally, which is pretty sweet because then we get to draw two cards. Sure. Good deal. Good deal. Give me red source to ki Oh, no, okay. No good deal. It was bad deal. Give me red source of braid. This is what we want. Volcanic island of braid. Man, this chat's really going going off the rails here. <laughs> All right, final answer. Trading the Trigon Predator. I like that better because now we get to keep our Skull Clamp. <clears throat> oh, we're halfway there. Living on a prayer. That's so sad. Why couldn't there be one land there? Seriously? That's stupid. Probably pitch Imperial Predator. Yeah, I guess that's true. I was thinking of Angel, but I think Angel's better than the long... The longness. The longness. <laughs> Whoa, 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 Mike's a lady. <clears throat> I didn't even know. Oh boy, talk about having it all. <clears throat> like a Cascade Bluffs here, then we can play a Braid and Magma Jet and kill this guy and this guy. Oh, it's a land. I'm going to put it on the bottom of your library. Oh, they kept it on top, so it's not a land, it's a four drop. <laughs> Rude. <clears throat> um... Whoa, 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 he's a lady. Do -do -do -ch -ch -ch. Gollum's gonna come in and play tapped, which is pretty sad. It is sad. I agree. I like blocking and they don't let me block. Oh my god, stop topping. <sighs> god. Good times. <clears throat> Everybody have fun tonight. Oh, look, a red source. Wow. What even? Sure. We're done here. I'm not going to deal with some treachery nonsense. I will bring in, like... I only have treachery, though. I don't think I care about that that much. It's obnoxious, but... I don't know if it's disenchantable. Nah. I think we're fine like this. We have 17 lands. I only drew four of them.
Fire Confluence seems worse now because you can't kill Planeswalkers with it. That is sad. I agree. Everybody might be tonight. What's your trench crush on the side? About 8%? Asking for a friend. Probably about 8%. Yeah, that seems about right. Just in chain gets rid of top two. Yeah, but who cares about top? <laughs> it barely gets rid of top. <laughs> You're probably very unlikely to get rid of a top when they can actually just activate top and put it on top. How many times did he say top in that sentence? To, 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 to top. You're only getting rid of top against very, very, very bad players. Walking Ballista could be good. That does kill a Jace. It also kills a Vendillion click pretty efficiently. You could probably get rid of Angel of Insanctions. Angel of Insanctions? Yeah. Wow. This gets rid of a Jace too, so... I don't like that idea. Cut a Braid. What? Cut a Braid. Why? Because that guy's better. Okay, I, I think that's fine. How many ruffle shuffles to achieve randomness in MTG? Like usually it's about seven. Everybody Wang Chung tonight. Why does he keep singing Wang Chung? I'll keep this hand. We could save this until we draw Monastery Mentor, but that seems a little greedy. Boy, do I hope we draw some lands, though. Uh, you are allowed to post links if you'd like. I used to have them blocked because who knows what people post, but yeah, go for it. Only if the YouTube, only links to a YouTube video of a six-minute long Japanese candy commercial. Wow. Uh, Amped, I don't think I understand your question. Is your mind so rude? All nighter cheeseburger Doritos? <laughs> Why? Oh, boy. This keep was a mistake. Two lands and five cards? I, I don't necessarily think so. The only thing better is if you're going to have three lands, three cards. I mean, <clears throat> this is castable with any one land. This is castable. These are the only two cards that aren't necessarily castable off of our off of our draw. So, let's get a hollowed fountain here. We don't have any red cards, and I'd like to make sure we have our. It's actually pretty good. <clears throat> We can actually just equip this guy next turn. We'll draw two off of that, and then we'll have one for the turn, and then we can activate library and have a million. So we're basically drawing four next turn. Sure. <clears throat> you got it. Long hair, don't care. Land off the top, please. Thank you. Okay. Woo! A little too dangerous. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. During upkeep, we can draw one? I guess we could just play something and draw one, too. Hopefully we draw land, I guess. That's where they go, Jace. Can we control magic at Jace? No. Still no? God, it's so sad. Mm -hmm. Oh, we tried to do it to Chandra too, didn't we? Yeah. 
I don't know, man. Magic rules are hard. If it's legendary, isn't it a creature, though? <laughs> might as well be. You might as well be. A creature? Yeah, I'm a creature. Do we do it now during upkeep? What, library? Yeah. Why not wait to draw a card? Uh, because if we draw a card, we're going to have eight cards. <clears throat> if we don't draw a land off the top, we're going to have to tap the library to cast something. Like a Blade Splicer. We could play Mother of Runes, but that's not ideal. So I'd rather draw a library, and then we have two chances to hit a land, and then we can play Blade Splicer off the lands. Eh, that's obnoxious. Why would you... Why would you not... I mean, like... It seems like just an easy, a very easy play to make. I, I'm intrigued. Nice. Nice. <clears throat> nice. Australian for nice. <laughs> um, I'm just going to play Blade Splicer again here. Or we can actually go... We can fire this dude and then play Mother. I think that seems good. We can fire your mother. Got it. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards. So if we do these two, we'll go down to six. We'll draw, and then we'll still have mana for this. Uh, cast fire on you. All right. I like it. Oh, I like it. We could just play Angel Invention next turn, too. We're probably just going to draw a card and play Blade Splicer. Here comes Crucible. You ready? That's not very impressive. It's actually not very impressive. Huh. Um, okay. And only attack with <laughs> the one this is... one. Uh, this is a suspect play, I'm going to be honest with you. And you wasted your Zealous artifact? Conscripts. That was very bizarre. Um, Let's control magic this, because if they have, like, Splinter Twin next turn... I like that. Or we can Angel of Sanctions it? Either way, we can draw a card Maybe first. Four, five, six, oh, wait, seven. No. no, we can't. No, we can't, we can't do, do both. both. But I think yeah. we are going to draw a card and then just play control magic on it it's still a 3-3 with haste and we get to attack with it yeah that might have been actually like we have splinter twin in our hand we're going to try to combo next turn so we're going to do this um so we're going to try to avoid Losing to that. Hey, man. Anybody hey. on your phone? Is your mom? There always is. There always someone on your phone? Yeah. It always feels like somebody's calling me. <laughs> Mother... That's actually, I was going to do the dancing song, but I meant to do the, uh, the Pink Floyd song. Yeah, drawing two cards a turn is actually really good. Did you guys know that? Did you know that? I tell, don't know. Tell Mike B not to walk my way. Oh, Mike B. <laughs> wow. Did you play Mirror Angel here? Or Brimaz? Mirror Angel's better, right? was more mana efficient i was more mana efficient once yeah why no more no the band's called faith no more <laughs> you want it all but you can grab it oh a restoration angel oh a restoration. um i think they definitely have kiki combo in this deck I'll resolve. Wait. What? I'm going to give it pro white so they can't block. They're just going to block it. But if they do have the combo, 
Oh, they don't have three red. You're good. Don't worry about it. Even if they do, I can't Mother of Runes their thing. Like, Can't you? No, it's target creature you control. Oh. What's wrong with me? I thought it was any target. I thought it was any target at all. And they can't Splinter Twin here. They have to have Kiki Jiki. They look pretty far from that. They look real far from a Kikums. That is not a red mana. Would library be balanced if the activation cost was one mana and tap it? It's still great, but you can't. Um, I think it might be significantly less playable if it was one mana and tap it. Like, yeah, that's a way bigger commitment. Oh, are you gonna Vendillion click me, bro? I don't care. My hand is stacked. Stacked. Stacks on stacks. We can actually play sword. <clears throat> Equip sword and uh, give Amiri Angel take sword. Pro White. Yeah, they can do that if they want. I don't even care, though. What do I care? I can see them taking sword. Kajiki Jiki. Yeah, that's that's what it's called. That's his name. Can we give ourselves protection? Kajikums Mixikums. What does he seek? The truth. He seeks the truth. Mm-hmm. They took sword. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm just going to play Angel of Sanctions and steal the resto. I played a land that triggered a thing. One, two, three, four, five. I'll draw a card. That will trigger another thing. <laughs> this card is busted, dude. We've drawn two cards a turn. Ooh, resto. Wait. Well, I want to give it back to them. That's not how that works. You sure? Yes, Resto returns it to under your control, not the honest owner's control. You get to keep it forever. Then we win, right? Well, no. <laughs> no. That doesn't mean that we win, but, I mean, we can blink this, steal this, we attack with this, this, this. Um, I want us to win. How did we, like, how would we have won there? I don't understand what you were seeing. I just saw those two pieces, and I'm like, oh, those are combo pieces. They go together, that means you win. Wow, that's, that's something. Um. Yeah, if you want to trade here, that's fine. You just give it a woozle. Correct. Wait, here? Whichever one they block. Well, if they block here, I'm not going to give it a pro blue because then the control magic falls off. Mm. That seems like a pretty bad play. I don't know if you knew that. I didn't think about that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they probably should have blocked there. Yeah, Seems but then like it's just two block. for one. No, I mean, they're at six, man. They're going to die. You're at six, and you're going to die. <clears throat> Eventually. Tonight. <laughs> oh. Well, so, well, if I end up dying tonight, we know who did it. I didn't say I did it. I am just said it was yeah, going to happen. Yeah, you did it. Just because I predicted it doesn't mean I did it. You did it. Apparently, oh, that was only game two? God, I thought we won that match. That's obnoxious. This is the match as long as time. It is the match as long as time. Do we see anything else? We saw Pentad Prism. That's about it. That is about it. You think Mike is working for your opponent tell you tell you to probe blue the conscripts and claim it and win with the resto? Yeah, I don't know, man. Those, those do seem both suspicious. Oh, you drew restoration names. That means we win, right? Uh, I don't think so. How do we win there? Oh, uh, I don't know. I just saw the two together. All right, that's weird. Hmm. Oh, just give the give the dude pro blue, right? No, then it would fall off. Oh, yeah, you're right. <laughs> it's my bad. <laughs> he said awkwardly. The green screen is making Mike look like he has a mullet. Yeah, we've been over this. That is the truth. I'll lean into it so it even looks better. 
I think we just play this now. That seems like a better turn to play. Seems better than Looter. Looter literally just draws the card, makes this card. Library just lets us draw it. Oh, they got the sad face again. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm, I bet you'll draw a strip mine. It'll be fine. <clears throat> now, they're, now they got to dig for that strippy. Strippy! I don't know why I said it like that. I think it's because I'm hungry and I need food. Blue Mage is hungry and needs food. That's from... That's from uh, Gauntlet. Remember Gauntlet? I'm going to eat some of these Reese's Pieces. Good for you. Don't spill them. When have I ever spilled the food I eat on stream? There was that one time. Never forget. The Raisin Incident. You're right. The Raisin Incident was a catastrophe. Reese's PCs. <laughs> Food, you say? Have you heard of Hungry Howies? I heard they're hundred percent natural. No, I don't. I don't believe they're harmful. Can we oblivion ring their shell dog aisle? Yes. Oh, for real? Mm-hmm. That's gas. I'll draw a card. I don't see why not. I knew it was actually was going to call Enlightened Tutor. Oh, my God. That's weird. You cast it. Yeah, but what's the point? Get a... Get a sword? I think we actually just go land, looter, keep up, library. I'd rather wait until we really need this. Scootin' doo doo, scooby doo 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 doo. Also, sword on Lutero core is pretty good. I don't know if you knew that. God, this top is. Look, they have seven minutes less than us. Oh, that's such a long time. <clears throat> like, I want you to just sit there, sit in your chair, set a timer for seven minutes. Oh, God, I'd kill myself. And just don't do anything and see how long seven minutes actually is. It's, it, it feels like less time because I'm sitting here playing a game of Magic and like it's it's broken down into like 20 seconds here, 15 seconds here. But seven minutes in total is a real long time. Yeah, me telling him to Oblivion Ring the Sheldock Isle was a trap. But, uh... Is where they go Resto into Red Source into Kikijiki and kill us? We might have to just play Opposition here. I don't know if that stops anything. Oh, it stops their land. We get to stop their land. Kick your acoustic sun out. <laughs> yeah. He's... Also, I guess we have Magma Jet to kill their Kiki-Jiki if they go Kiki-Jiki. Kiki-Jiki. Oh, Kiki-Jiki. Oh, GK. Oh, GK. I'm in love with you. Should we draw a card here? No. Do you ever feel like you've drawn too many cards and you're like, I can't draw anymore? Oh, that's a good one. That's never happened. Oh, that's a real goodie. That's a gem burgle if I ever saw a gem burgle. Um, that's annoying. That is annoying. Whatever. <laughs> Take whatever you want. I don't even care at this point. Oh, Jiki. They're going to take the Magma Jet, I bet. Going to take Magma Jet, I bet. And then we can just go land Oblivion Ring that thing. I, I was I was actually afraid of Resto into Kiki Jiki, so this is better. But if they Restoed, we could have Force Spiked. Drawing Force Spike is pretty bad because they get to see it, but... It makes the potential for Gotham's real low. Yeah, but they still might not... They'll Although, just, they have to play around it all game, which is pretty annoying. For them. <laughs> Please don't ever make that noise again. I, I make no promises. But I may make the noise. Which is kind of like a promise. What do they take? Oblivion Ring? 
They're a real fan of taking the blue ring, apparently. So we get to put one of these on top. I'll bottom the land. I'll put the walking ballista on top just because it's good with like Jace. Oh, Gina. That noise matches this. <laughs> I try to make the bit noise, uh, make it real. That was a verbal gif. What do we get rid of here? A verbal gif, huh? Do you just get rid of opposition here? It seems bad in this hand. But is it ever really bad? Seems reasonable to get rid of that. Or we can get rid of Enlightened Tutor. It also seems reasonable. Yeah, we can get rid of Enlightened Tutor. We have most of the targets except for the equipment anyway, so it's pretty fine. We have Opposition, Control Magic, Oblivion Ring is gone. I guess it's in the deck still, but... This is only turn four. I'm really surprised about that. It seems like... top. I no, know, I'm right? Like... like I'm like, oh, eight minutes now. Eight minutes more than us now. Oh, boy. Like, we also play off-curve by one mana every turn, but that's just because we're drawing an extra card every turn, and that seems like a pretty small price to pay. Trigon Predator. That seems good. We don't actually have any artifacts or enchantments. I don't really care about that. So we're going to land, mentor, next time we can actually go <clears throat> opposition, keep up four spike mana if we get it, and uh, now opposition looks a lot better. Any other blue source though? Not a blue source, but pretty good. Just gonna get rid of planes here. We get to draw another card from the library anyway, so. They're also missing land drops? They missed a land drop? That's weird when you have top. Top again! Well, we don't have any on the board, is what I'm saying. I mean, I understand we have some in our deck, yes, or in our hand even. But my my point is, like, we don't have to worry about this guy getting through. We don't have to prevent this guy from attacking because we have nothing really in play here. Just tap all your mana. Don't even worry about it. Um, I kind of just want to force spike this to get another mentor guy. I can see that. Let's draw a card first. That's pretty good. We can also go Walking Ballista next turn. We can go Opposition. So now they have to tap out, which is just great. I always yield to both of these. I'll pay it. You gonna bounce mentor? You kind of have to bounce mentor here, I think. So we can go land, draw a card, play sword, equip sword, attack you, kill Jace, but then we lose the sword to the Trigon Predator. But I mean, we get to get rid of a Jace the Mind Sculptor, which is pretty strong. Just bounce this guy? Oh, wow. Oh, that's that's not going to end well for you. <laughs> All right. So we 
just opposition here and make another guy. Do we draw a card first? Maybe. Or do we just play Walking Blista for two? Probably draw a card, right? Probably. If we want to do that in the future. Right. It just keeps us online. Oh, that was such a good draw. Holy magolies. What does he mean when he says stuff like that? That was a really good draw. And let's kill Jace. This is match two. It is game three. Good game. Sorry for playing slowly. <laughs> oh, it's, it's okay. We have good time. Good games. All right. Our deck is pretty sweet. Uh, we're not going to consider this for the stipulation for um, for Eerie or Skinny. Because we didn't get any infinite combos, so I'll wait till we get an infinite combo, and then we'll actually use that one. Infinite Guy. bows. <laughs> uh. I mean, we kind of went infinite with Library of Alexandria, right? Email me so I know you potato. So I know you potato. What are you saying right now? Um, you know, man, email me so you know I potato. I don't watch me potato. Wow, that was such a good draw. This is a perfect curve. Look at this. This is just just beautiful. And then we can enlighten tutor for opposition and then have a million deeds on the board. Don't care about that at all. I think you should attack for one. Just to, just to send a message? Mm -hmm. The message is that we're bad and we threw our mother of runes away. That would be the message. Ew, you're skinny. I, I go live every day at 2 p.m. And uh, you should get notifications on Twitch when I go live. All right, that's fine. That's very good. Okay, I hope they attack. Oh, my God. Is this real life? Well, gas. <laughs> Fantastic. That was a strange decision. Oh boy, we have a good time. Bro, have you ever mothered of runes? Wow, that was good times. And we gained two. <laughs> Just like, you know, YOLO. They're probably like a 1-1 one, one for one. What does that even do? Oh, I see. That guy's fine. He don't even care about Magma Jet, though. No, he care about it. Do he? Yeah. He care about it much. It gonna make him die. Let's let's see if we can get through again. <laughs> Cause you know what, man? Oh boy. Oh dang, it would have been too good. Keep it ignoric for now. Yeah, I don't really care about it right now. I'll just keep him lightning tutor because then we can actually get skull clamp. Or opposition, actually. This is opposition territory for sure. 
Yeah, that seems better. They could tap down one of our lands, but who knows? Flicky Wink Whisperson. You blink a land. Okay. Okay. Scooby did it do do do. My problem with getting that is they can tap down this and then we can't play anything for our turn. So I actually think we can wait here. Whereas right now we can magma gen in response. And try to hit a land. Mm, I don't want either of these, unfortunately. I do want to land. Land one time. That was a good draw. Yep, we're doing pretty good here. 30 life. Mother of Rins is a hell of a card, man. It's pretty good. Mother of Runes, serious wizard. Yeah, that's fine. A little scary, but... Really? 30. I'll go to 24. No blocks. Wow, that's aggressive. I mean, they can't really block anyway. Why not? I guess we can make it so they can't block, but... Yeah. I mean, we can make it so one guy can't block. <sighs> Oh, Gene. Oh, Gene. Actually, Sword might be stronger than Opposition here, oddly enough. No, nothing is stronger than Opposition. You gonna port me, bro? Doesn't even matter. But in the end, it doesn't even matter. Three, four. All right, go to five. That lifelink on Tutor, though. Yeah, that was pretty sweet. Enlightened Tutor has lifelink. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Ew, you're skinny. Give me another stipulation for the draft so that, uh... Yeah, this is fine. I'm not going to tap anybody down. Um, So that if we don't get any combo pieces... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I don't think I care about that. What if they have... There's no way they have, like, Wrath of God, right? I guess we'll find out. Sure. They have one card. Me thinks they're dead. Me also thinks that. Maybe they didn't read opposition either. One card to rule them all. And in the darkness, bind them. Burning of Zenyi and Wildfire are both in the cube. Are they? Yep. I haven't seen them in a, in a hot minute. All right, so they go Legion's Landing into Concede. Seems good. This actually seems like a, a walking ballista matchup if I ever saw one. They got a bunch of 1-1 one -one nerds. Fire Confluence is also pretty brutal, right? Oh, uh, it is, but again, the double red is really hard. We only have four red sources. Yeah. I think we have five, but still. We have two mountains. A seam oh, okay, because the Delta, sure. Sure, Michael. Sure. I wouldn't have to say it if you weren't wrong. That's true. God, I hate being wrong. Our deck seems great. Mm, take out Tudor. It seems weird. Why would you take that out? Take out the recruiter. 
I'll take out the recruiter instead of the tutor, I guess. Recruiter the tutor? No. Yes. No, no one's doing that. My dad. Your dad's not doing that. You're right, he probably isn't. My dad. Oh, what if we had Bonfire with this Soulfire Grandmaster? That'd be pretty sick. However, the problem with Bonfire is that it'll never be there when we want it to be. You always draw it on, like, turn one or two. It's always in your opening hand. Every time. Here comes the backhand, Mike. Don't you sass me, boy. <laughs> No, father, don't hit me again. Don't tell me what to do. Can we get that turn one mother of runes again? Because that was pretty epic. <laughs> Especially when they brick their guy into it. <laughs> so, what you got? Wait, one one? All right, I'll tuck my... You got two two? I'll tuck my Thalia. Um, okay. This hand seems pretty good. Yeah, this hand seems fine. I wish we had a two drop, but I'm sure we'll just draw Mother of Runes off the top. No. That wasn't Dang it. Dang it. Uh, we have that fetch. Oh. What are we saving it for? Amiria Angel, bro. Oh, I was, I'd rather just get Hollow Fountain here so we have double white. We don't even have double white for Amiria Angel, bro. We draw it. Wow. You can decide that later. <laughs> you can decide it later. Whatever. It's too late. It's yeah. too late to apologize. Now I'm going to save the Skull Clamp for Monastery Mentor, though. But okay. The only one getting backhand is Alexis. She's later on Frank turning. <laughs> That's true. She's doing that. I like Honor the Pure with an Empty Board. I <laughs> too. I'm like, what's going on right now? Um, Let's just go Blade Splicer here, because next turn we can go Mentor into Skull Clamp, which is pretty good especially if they have like mana tithe here what hand did they keep here this is very strange Gotham God Fiend Hunter so long Gollum See you later, Schmeagle. Oh, dang. So this puts us to four cards. We draw a card for the turn, which would put us to five. We can activate Skull Clamp on Blade Splicer, which puts us to seven. Then we can activate Library and draw a card. So, uh, hey, that's pretty good. No attacks. I think we're winning. Oh, I feel like we're winning less now. I guess we have Oblivion Ring. Oblivion Ring also makes a mentor gentleman. A mentorman. If you know what I'm saying. A monk ass. Uh, what? A monk ass. Does it make... Oh, yeah, okay, sure. A monastery... Yeah, it's a, it makes a monk ass. <laughs> that's actually... That's actually very funny, Michael. I'm actually very pleased with your joke. Funny joke. Funny joke. It was yeah, we'll never library. Oh, we'll library. Let's attack first, huh? Good call. Oh, thank you. you. Uh, 
Yeah, we have seven cards now, so I think we're just fine. I think our library is just Filling fine. Up. Our library's filling up? Mm hmm. Doesn't even make any sense. Sure does. You gotta fill the library to draw cards. Storm does seem likely. I don't wanna talk about it. Oh, dang. Alright, you could, you could take my skull clamp. But you'll never take my library. But you'll never take me library. Alright, so we can play a land. We can also play a Miri Angel. And then draw. And then land. And then always yes to these birds. And... I always say yes to the bird. <laughs> what does that even mean? One, two, three, four. One, two. If we draw a two drop, we're in good shape. Because then we can go opposition two drop, draw a card with library. Oh, three, three knights? It doesn't matter as much. Oh, four, four knights? Oh my goodness gracious. It's a little bit more scary. I do declare. Well, that's a two drop. One, a two, three, four. Oh, a popo. I think the game is over. Also a card. Oh, one, two, three. Yeah, that's fine. No, we'll actually keep this guy back. I don't think the one damage is worth the uh, the extra land we can tap. This should be the victory. I want to make sure we always tap correctly. Oh my god. It always, it's like a lag. Okay. Choose this one. Alright. There we go. I never want to tap my own guy. Because that's pretty bad. Alright. If you have a way to untap your board, I think we just win. Opposition's a hell of a drug. It's pretty good. This deck turned out great. Alrighty then. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Unfortunately, nice. we didn't... Yeah, it is nice. Unfortunately, we didn't get our uh, Ilya Skinny stipulation in, which is draft the infinite combos. But our deck still turned out pretty sweet, even when that was kind of our goal and we were trying to skewing toward... Kind of skewing our draft towards that. Either way, thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons if you enjoyed the video. Check out my Patreon page and my Twitch profile below if you want to submit a stipulation or a deck critique. Both of those are in the description. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.